Dude, why, why, why am I sitting so proper in my own house? Yeah, I, I, I own this house, right? But <laughs> look at me. I'm like, yes. <laughs> but we have apples, bananas, whatever you may need. Be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and we'll post something to ring the button. We get a good thing. We upload here. <laughs> Brookhaven. We love Brookhaven and Roblox. And dude, I, <laughs> there I am. I'm sitting down again. But uh, today I wanted to talk about something really crazy because we all own a Brookhaven house normally, right? You join into a lobby, you move into a home, and it's a, it's a fantastic event, a series of events. You know, sometimes you're house can be haunted we've had a lot of cases with haunted houses i don't recommend anybody inspired to bring any ghost into their home i know a lot of people don't really have uh, <laughs> that luxury of deciding if a ghost haunts their house or not sometimes their house is just already haunted which is kind of spooky but hit the like button if you don't want your house to be haunted by a ghost guys i wouldn't risk it if you don't like this video your goal a ghost might haunt you dude. don't risk it i'm telling you but either way we have a slide in this house which gets me like look you can close this or open it so if you don't want your guest sliding down hurting themselves because this, this is kind of dangerous right you could kind of close this and kind of it, it's customizable in a unique way and that's one of the cool things about the brookhaven homes a lot of them have customized <laughs> oh, dude let me get my words right here. they have customizable options about them that other houses don't have like I, I mean we have some crazy houses in the catalog here guys uh from the rp sets i mean what other game is letting you have a submarine house that shoots some missiles out of the top of it right <laughs> that's absolutely crazy right uh so, of course, you have, like, the little playhouse. You have the uh, the race car houses for racing. Uh, we have a SpaceX house for Pete's sake, dude. It don't get much better than that, right? But here's something really interesting. The availability to be able to renovate these houses in different various ways. What do I mean? Well, we can renovate our house slightly. So, right here, I could change the color of some of my walls by going blue. So, as you can tell, like, cool, cool. I'm able to paint my walls blue, yellow for one. There's no homeowners association in in Brookhaven well maybe there is a little bit but um as regards to painting some of my house yellow I can do that just not all of it so I guess there is a little bit of an HOA in its own unique way but uh still we can kind of customize it a little bit which is a great thing we can lock our doors if we have premium we can usually spawn a house pool if we ever so desire now our house pool here it, it goes here oh uh, perfect so if you guys notice that slide now nobody's gonna get hurt okay it used to just be concrete look at this you would slide down well, not concrete but grass which still wouldn't possibly feel the best but now we can add a pull here so whenever you slide down whenever the guests are over like dude i want to go slide down the cool slide you got to don't even worry about it look at that right here let's open it up and i'm out whoa into the water dude. it's a good time it's a good time so yeah the ability to be able to customize your house has always been a great asset to Brookhaven. Be able to change things, customize things, but there's been one thing we have not been able to do much of. And uh, well, that I'm hoping is going to be introduced in the future. Of course, we have the baby option, which you can change all your house furniture to. Well, you can baby proof it, I guess, and add baby furniture, uh, which does change the visuals of the house. Now, I've talked about this a lot, and I still want to see a, a, like a, a pet option. So you can put like your pet bowls, or if you have a cat, like a litter box, or something like that. You know, I'll optimizing the house for if you live with a lot of pets you like to have a couple cats you know or you want a dog or something it would make sense to be able to have some stuff that's optimized towards that so um, that's kind of cool too and this obviously removes all props and sleeping bag if somebody's coming in your house they're trolling you press this right here you can remove all that now we do have the uh, the fire on demand which i don't see many people use but we have the disaster pack which allows us to cr control our house and add all kinds of weird disasters but there's one thing we can't do and that is renovate our house be it if we want to change the color of each wall or if we want to change the furniture inside our home we can't even do that i can't even change the sofa color dude this is the most bland looking so far i've ever seen in my life dude it's complete white it's almost like it doesn't have any texture at all the same for the rug like this is the most bland most plain rug i have ever seen in my life dude outside with the couches you know matching it up on it but it could be the theme of the house i suppose but i would definitely love the option to be able to change my couch's color my rugs design or colors as well uh and be able to change this different furniture colors or customize them uh to my liking you know especially a rug guys we we should be able to have like an option where we could turn on like renovation or something and we can click on our rug and change the color to blue or a nice pattern uh, aztec based design that just really seems more like a rug would look right um so that that would be really cool to have that customization and the reason why i'm bringing this topic to the table now is because people have been wanting to renovate their homes or change the, their furniture around or the color of their furniture for the longest time 
time now. It's been something that we've been t anticipating and talking about on the channel, the ability to be able to change your, uh, your, your, your furniture or change the color of your furniture. Now, some houses do let you, uh, if you change your house color, many different parts of the house, I think I, there was one that allowed you you could change the color of the chairs because it was connected to that part that allows you to change but maybe you want like um, a victorian style dresser or something like that I, i'm really curious to see if wolfpack would be able to implement that in some way to make the houses more customizable to the theme that we set uh, for thing because guys consider this there's the theme pack right you have the themes here that change the whole world to a selective theme what if you could do that in your house like your houses could have themes as well maybe a theme pack for houses or it could just kind of fall in this category somehow or bundle with the theme pack your houses could have multiple different themes now this would obviously be a job on its own that would mean that you know every other house except the rp sets the rp sets this wouldn't be available on but most and every other house you would be able to change the theme of that house to your liking a victorian style or a, a more modern sleek uh, style or a futuristic style this would be a really cool thing to play with and see if that could be something that could be introduced later down the line so like i said the rp sets houses obviously wouldn't be available for this feature but it would be really cool to be able to change the theme of our furniture and the whole visual of our home inside uh, as well um, now will this be something that happens i don't know what would you guys like to see and what would you like to change inside your home uh, in Brookhaven. Dude, I didn't even realize it goes all the way up here, dude. We gotta go in from the top, dude. That's amazing. I didn't know you could go all the way up there. But yeah, so let me know what you guys in the comment section below would like to change in your house. Would you like to be able to change the color of your couch, furniture, or be able to rearrange your furniture, even so, uh, in some way? I don't know. I think these are all interesting concepts and ideas that Wolfpack could play around with and consider going forth into the future because there's really no limits to what can be done in Brookhaven. It really just depends if it makes sense, if it kind of is balanced and it works properly. Um, and uh, that's what it really boils down to, right? I mean, it, obviously, if we can change the color of all of our furniture and change the design, but it doesn't seem balanced or really connect to Brookhaven's, you know, Brookhaven's basic uh, foundation it would kind of be out of place right so it, it has to be done very carefully um, but we could see some theme pack furniture packs or something down the line in the future uh, depending on where the updates take us uh, throughout the ongoing future so that's that's what I think I, I personally think somewhere down the line we could see furniture packs uh, furniture themes uh, that would change the theme of our furniture depending on the house uh, but you know that would be a big update I feel like for Wolfpack having to go through all the houses and change that uh, to that degree but still it's a cool idea we have some really cool houses and don't forget guys we also have the estates now uh, which is a whole new uh, thing to experiment around with the estate pass that just got un uh, unlocked and of course we have the the, the, the apartments. With the apartments, you get the specification of like the skate shop, you know, with the skateboards and everything in between there. So there's still a lot of possibilities. And I feel like there's definitely more estates coming soon, which are going to be RP sets. So there could be theme parks or something absolutely off the wall that takes everybody by surprise. And I'm more than ready to uh, see what is in store for the next update and the update after that. So. Uh, basically though that's what i want to talk about guys make sure you let me know in the comment section below what you would like to see added or changed into the house would you like to be able to renovate your house definitely let me know i think there's a lot of cool possibilities and ideas going forward uh, for future updates so with that aside dude updates from o1g it's a great time dude um we're still uploading as much and often as we can on the channel every day uh, and still keeping up with the updates. I know I've been absent from live streaming for so long, dude, and it pains me so much. I did mention this in a few uh, videos back that I have been encountering many obstacles in life right now, many little bumps to overcome and uh, just get you know it, it, to persevere through i guess you could say we all encounter it at some point in time and uh once we get all that settled uh then we're going to be back at live streaming full force we're going to be back uh live streaming the updates and uh giving it our 100 percent all of course um which i cannot wait for because i know a lot of people are like dude we're just a new update but there's no live stream what's going on the live streams were the best first off dude they were <laughs> they i don't know if they were the best but they were so much fun 
to be able to get the experience. So I'm hoping to bring the live streams back once I get everything resolved and uh, we get everything rolling 100%. But till then, dude, we got amazing updates and we got amazing videos coming out at a daily pace. Nothing's going to change there. So with that aside, love you guys so much. 360 dude. Okay, let's get it. Come on, let's get my big box and get out of here.